taking longer than I thought it would, but... Trigger duration. Okay, 0.5. I think that should be good. Yeah, it's kind of annoying doing triggerable events, so this whole ride's gonna be, like, extremely frustrating. But... Because <laughs> this whole ride is just one big triggerable event. Essentially. Alright, so back to the spotlights. So these are all going to be like different colors for each se each section. Um, this first section should be probably like a red color, I'd say. So basically, I want this to be like so many triggerable events that'll like be seizure inducing. Like you shouldn't come out of this with like your eyes working. Like this should like totally make you blind. Okay, we're going to stick with the spotlights. They're like the brightest, so they're the best for this have this one be like like a yellow maybe I have to see what this looks like though uh, yellow yellow really doesn't do that much so I'm, I'm gonna go for like a green so the color events will probably be just like a splash of color just like um like, every single time it comes up against this, it'll just do, like, dude, that color, dude, that color. But I'm gonna want to put in, like, just regular spotlights, just, like, white ones. Just be, they'll be, like, pointing, like, all directions. So I'm gonna put those in. Um, that's probably enough for seizures right now, so that, that's good. We're gonna have like a billion trigger events. Okay, I have an idea. I'm just gonna copy that whole thing. Yeah, that'll be like way faster than redoing the whole thing all over again. We can just have like a crap ton of these then. Like that. Duplicate it again. All I have to do is like change the colors and that's it. Yeah, my computer's like gonna die. <laughs> If it, like, it, it'll probably die after this is all said and done. Um, or the game will crash, one or the other, because there's just going to be so many things in this going on all at once. It's going to be a mess, but it's going to be totally worth it. Oh, should I go, like, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do, like, <laughs> like every single block, there's going to be one of these things up there. Okay, Michael Bay ride, here we go. <laughs> They're gonna go through that whole thing, it's just gonna be like a bunch of freaking lights all over the place. And I just have to change the colors. Red color wheel, here we go. With that color. If that color will <laughs> will hurt people physically. It'll 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 cause damage to, to like the visitors. Okay, so. Yeah, the color palette, it's its like so much better. I should be using this like way more. We'll go with like cyan, lime green. Okay. Oh, there's so, there's so much more I have to do. Holy crap. Okay. We'll go with like orange. We're going to go with like a seafoam green. Go with like a purple actually. All right, so this one, um, Jesus. Um, we'll just go like regular blue. Um, you know what? I'll leave that green. We haven't done green in a while. Like, I'm running out of colors. There aren't enough colors. We could try orange again. Yeah, um, basically how today worked, for me at least, is... I was gonna try to wake up at like a normal time. But what happened is, is I like looked at the clock when I woke up and it was like 4.30. It was like 4.30 p.m. And it's like, Jesus. Which is weird because the day before I woke up at 6 a.m. Like, my sleep schedule is just so fucked. It's probably because I'm on spring break right now, and I'm <laughs> I'm just doing, like, a bunch of streaming and shit. That's probably why. Oh. Okay, this looks really cool. Like, honestly. Already. 
Let's see. Turn on the lights. Turn them on. Oh, wow. Okay, so the thing is... Okay. I think there's just too many goddamn lights. It's like, you can't even see the color. Like, my computer's like, oh, what should I do? I don't know. I give up. Okay, but the thing is, is that as soon as, as um, this is triggerable, I think that'll help things, like, drastically. So what I actually have to end up doing... And this is going to take, like, probably even longer. Okay, yeah, we're going to have to add, like, a crap ton of triggers. One. First thing that's going to happen, these red lights are going to happen. Probably, like, right before is what we're aiming for. So, like, right there, we'll add that, add that. Um, each trigger, we're going to have to add one of these, like, just regular lights. I'm going to add another for the red lights. We're going to add another for these. Each one of these, like, regular lights, yeah, I'm gonna want a separate event <laughs> for each one. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to redo all this, but... Yeah. I don't think I did that one yet. I don't think I did that one yet. Um, this is gonna take, like, forever. Like, literally. Don't know if I did that one yet. Um, I'm gonna do this at nighttime, actually. And this will make this, like, a lot easier. I don't... Oh, I have to play it. Oh, wait, no, it is playing. Yeah, that, that's really annoying, how it, how it, like, shows them on, even though they're, like, not really. So we'll do, like, the crazy, like, lights all over the place thing. It's, like, not as fast as I'd like it to be. I think it's just because it's on the chain lift right now, though. I say we do five for each thing, and the one in the middle is going to be the one with the actual color in it. Okay, I, I'm, I'm planning out a way to actually... There's, there's a way to do this, so I'm going to add just these three. I'll, like, switch it up each time. A little bit, just so it's not like the same thing. But I'm gonna have to do some sort of way, so it, so I even know what I'm doing. Oh, I have to scroll down every time. That's gonna be a pain in the ass. Is there like a max amount of triggers I can do? Yeah, if I just add a crap ton of triggers, just like that. Is there a limit? Take that! Yeah, do me a favor. Fuck off! Get out! Get out of my oh, you can only do 50. Oh no. Yeah, that's disappointing. I didn't think that- I totally forgot about, like, the trigger limit. Each one of these things could only use just one trigger, and, um, each of the, like, the basic lights, those could just be, um, like, as soon as it gets to, like, this color, then, like, one just, like, just some random one just down, down the line will just go off, just to give it, like, more of an effect. So I could do that. Jesus. I didn't even know this part was going to take this long. I'm going to have to redo this. Look how little of this building is actually taken up just by this intro part. It's it's going to be crazy. There's going to be so many triggerable events. So like if we use 10 there, maybe it wouldn't be that big of a deal. Because this is the longest. It's going to be the slowest part probably just right here. So I think that's actually okay. Here's how I'm going to do it. Every other of these. Okay, it can let me do a bunch of objects per trigger, just like not that many. Okay, done. Next trigger. Oh shit, I just realized. I for I've been forgetting like to put the ones on the back. But actually, a way I could resolve the issue of like having some on, I could just put one that links to like every single light, just at the end. And that just solve all the issues.
Okay, so the look I'm going for is kind of like a runway sort of light system. Every single one of these I'm gonna want to last longer than like, than a half a second. And I'm only gonna want to activate probably four at a time. I've spent like two hours just on the triggers alone, it's pretty crazy. Alright, so we can look, see what that looks like. We might have to extend the time that those are on. But other than that, I think this is actually starting to shape up. Actually, I think that looks fine. I'm gonna actually do ride cam, see what it looks like when I ride it. So here we are actually riding the beginnings of the ride. There's a red. Okay, and it just goes outside, and then once it gets back in, the explosions begin. Yeah, and then they all just die. Okay, here I'm probably going to want to put a sign. And it's going to be like the epic drop, and you're going to you're gonna know. Okay, I have a really good idea, actually. So, <laughs> the sign is going to like go on here, and as it goes by, the sign's going to explode, and you're going to go down. I don't know, it seems like that text is like bigger, for whatever reason. I'm gonna undo that. There's a better way. See, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put like one sign, and it's gonna be like red, and then it's gonna say the ride in like smaller text. Okay, so we're gonna add like a crap ton of explosions and it'll go on there. Oh shit. Mecheho <laughs> Bay. Um, I'll put like explosions on there now. Actually, we need like every single explosion there is in the in this thing. Western explosion. Alright, so we'll put three of those like that and four of them up here. And the sci-fi ones. We'll have one that like circles the entire thing, like completely. There can never be like enough explosions. What they should do in this game is make it so, like, it defaults on the bottom. <laughs> you have to scroll down every goddamn time I add, add a trigger. You can't make a good <laughs> Michael Bay ride if it doesn't have this much shit in it. Here we go. And then they explode. It happens, like, a little too late. I think that's still okay, though. Like, once you're going through, it explodes right as you go down. So, I think that's what I was aiming for anyway. The only, like, basically the lighting will work better when I can, like, adjust where the triggers happen. So, like, it works with, like, the Linkin Park song that's gonna be going on in the background. That's gonna be pretty cool. I might start with the, like, the clock room or whatever I was gonna do in here. 